everybody, how's it going? So what you see here in front of you is a total of 60 grams of 999 fine silver uh, that I recently won in an auction on eBay. And I decided to go ahead and dump it inside of this tiny little treasure chest that I just picked up from my local craft store called Hobby Lobby. Uh, they had a 40% coupon off any single item. Uh, so I picked this up for a whopping $1.80. Uh, figured can't really beat that price you might as well and I think it's a pretty cool little storage bin for my uh, my one gram pieces uh, but let me go ahead and give you a closer look at um, what I won I picked up 30 of these one gram rounds and let me see if I can get my camera to focus a little better here I uh, picked up 30 of these which they call their skull queen round uh, the overall diameter of this is 13 millimeters so uh, pretty tiny uh, as you can see there, it's almost paper thin. Uh, and here on the back side, it says 1 gram, 0.999, fine silver. Uh, overall, I think it's a pretty good looking design. Happy to have that. Um, I also picked up uh, 30 of their 1 gram bars. Let me get one out here for you, give you a closer look at it. Um, they call this the F-35 fighter jet bar. And... Uh, so you can see it says 1 gram, 0.999 fine silver, and the dimensions of this bar is 15 millimeters by 10 millimeters, so once again really small, uh, paper thin there, and uh, here on the back it's got that nice diamond pattern to it. Uh, but overall I'm pretty happy with these pieces, 60 grams of uh, 999 fine silver. So one thing you got to worry about when buying silver on eBay is if it's real or not. And, uh, you know, when I do this, it sure sounds like real silver to me, but uh, still, you never really know. So I'm going to go ahead and perform um, two more tests on these uh, one gram pieces just to see if everything checks out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grab my scale. And I have it set to grams. And I'm going to go ahead and just weigh a few of these here to see if everything checks out. Go ahead and start with this one gram round. And that one weighs in at one gram, so that's good. Go ahead and grab a bar this time. And that one checks out, one gram. And this one is one gram, so three for three. We'll go ahead and uh, test one more of these out. And the fourth one's good too, one gram. So four for four, uh, that's a good sign. Let's go ahead and move on to the uh, ice test. All right, so as you may or may not know, uh, silver is one of the best conductors of thermal energy. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a little piece of ice and place it on this one gram round. And we should see this piece of ice melt almost instantly. And as I'm looking at it, it looks like it's doing just that. It's melting very, very fast. Uh, let me go ahead and grab a piece of ice for the one gram bar now and see if it does the same thing. And I don't know about you, but it looks like it's melting very, very fast. And that's a great sign. It usually means that it's real silver. Um, we, we did two tests. We went ahead and weighed four of these pieces. And uh, all four checked out. They all weighed in at one gram. And it looks like it passed the ice test as well. Um, this one is absolutely freezing in my fingers right now. And that's a good sign. Um, you know, the, the seller that I bought these from on eBay... I uh, had 99.7% uh, positive feedback from over 30,000 members, so, um, you know, I have no doubt that these are real silver now. I just want to double check. Uh, let me go ahead and stack these up for you now. All right, so for those of you still watching, might be wondering what I paid for these uh, 60 gram pieces. And um, as you all know, uh, fractional silver usually come with a very high premium. And that's exactly why I usually stay away from fractional silver, uh, besides constitutional silver. But um, uh, believe it or not, I actually got these for under spot price. Um, you know, 30 grams of silver is just about one troy ounce. Uh, so I got two troy ounces here uh, for a total of $31.99 um, after shipping. So that's about $16.50 per ounce. Um, and when I bought these, silver spot price was about sixteen eighty-five. So, you know, I think I got a pretty good deal on them. Um, you know, if you buy these individually on eBay, they're usually selling for about a dollar a piece, which is outrageous. Or if you try to buy these on uh, on Atmex, they're selling for well over a dollar a piece. So, um, you know, overall, I got a pretty good price on it. Very happy. 
And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I do appreciate you guys watching. Uh, have a nice day, and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.